fam7754 and I'm g this video is to show you how to get onto the leaderboard for the global event blackout so the way it works is that you've got to do higher you've got to get global event credits per hour and the way it works is the higher the more activities you do that gives you G credits the higher on the leaderboard you'll get. So tier one I believe is the there's no reward, tier one, tier two, and then tier three. So as you see there's nothing because what happens is every day at 8 p.m. Eastern time zone it will update the it'll update it for you. When the daily is reset, it'll update the leaderboard and it'll show how much you've gotten per hour and get you yeah it'll show how much you've done in that hour and it'll update your position the more one thing that I know is that doing a starting with the legendary that will give you like 1500 GE credits right off the bat and with these it doesn't start until you pick up your first GE credit. So, just so you know, what I'm gonna show you is uh, how I can get, how you can get to tier three with not much effort, if you will. And the way that I do this is, first of all, I have strong builds, and as you see, I'm I'm running Nomad. 6400 firearms, 6800 stamina, so I can put out damage and take a lot of damage. And this event is blackout, so that means that you have shock ammo. I mean, the baseline, which this would be, you don't overshock yourself. So, what I'm gonna do is the way I do it is I'll start with the weekly high value targets there's eight of them four that are just normal then you have four that are high risk and if you fail doing those then you've got to spend the credits again to get that and then I will switch I'll finish it up with doing the daily HVTs, the six of um, them. So here it is, gonna start it off I with have faith Digger. In you, Go get him. And the other thing that you want to make sure is that you clear your backpack up Man, so you can just for my feet do these activities break. back after, just do them back after back after back and back back to back to back to back and not have to worry about clearing your backpack up because the most that way you can really help go through the lists go through the HVTs quicker a little bit quicker and you don't want to spend location. time trying to figure out what Wanted. to keep and You're now leaving the safe area. so here we go Morning. Hostiles detected nearby. Throwing up my seekers. There we go, I'm just picking out while they're shocked. Warning. Additional hostiles incoming. New wave of enemies. I would stay up on the top, but this is going for trying to quickly get these done. I'm being extremely aggressive. If you can't do it, then you're probably shit. You could stay up there. Back where I was. Now I don't see so. Yeah, they're coming from over here. Getting up, shooting up. Hostile 
Bravos incoming. Another wave. Back. Take a shot. Now they're starting to be elites. So that means you get close to the end of the way. Picking up all the loot that was picked up. And now fast traveling back to the hey. terminal. Gonna do the next one. Let's talk. This kind of stuff Lombardi, is making a big difference which are gliders, the Thanks for taking which that are on. grenades. So now got that. Because I want to maximize the run, I want to get there sooner rather than later. I'm going. Usually, I would go and pick up the electronic fabric tools. In this case, I'm just gonna ignore them because that takes time off the clock. That takes time. That will. That impacts me. And the only thing I'll stop for is if I have someone to help donate food donate something as you see him coming down this side um, the bomb killed that person that might have been asking me for resources thanks I guess I get to live a little longer. You get target intel, plus I believe there's accommodation for donating to... Yeah, donating resources, but anyway, that's for... Later. You can always search, find that out when you search the accommodations. But anyway, moving on, now just heading here. Location. Here we are. Warning. Hostile detected nearby. Reload. Throw my sticky bomb out. I mean my good name. My Zika mines. Okay, shooting them. Focus on them one at a time. The goal is to get Lost through this as coming. quickly as possible so that you can keep moving. So the veterans, when you release, as you progress in doing the weekly and daily, the daily will be more. Hello, additional hostiles inbound. 
so this is where if you've got good strong builds you can help just blow by the new one Incoming. Yeah, the Somehow gotten my backpack completely full. So now what I'm gonna do quickly is I'm gonna go ahead and deconstruct stuff to clear up space. And now fast traveling to back to the terminal, and I'm gonna be working on the second one. So now area. I'm real quickly gonna take a look. go here. Mark everything mm. that I don't want. And I'm just gonna do a mass mm. sale. Sorry, I can't give you a bag. Selling bulk. Mm. And now, time to work on the next the one. Lieutenant Creek. Now, where is he located? I can't wait to put my feet up. It's a, there's a little bit of problem with a glitch in the game, is that sometimes it'll tell you immediately. Oh, there it is, back at Napalm Production Site. Marked location. Now here, turning around. Warning. Now we're exiting the safe area. The Warning. Secret mines go. While they're closing, the next wave is behind me. I mean, not now behind me, but going straight there. Jumping over, here they come. Still fetching. Incoming hostiles detected. 
they come should be elites, and they all... Is this gonna be the... Looks like it might be... Glitched out. Sometimes with this there'll be glitches with... Just have to wait a little bit. And me blown killing them that meant... Got me to bleed because the cluster is secret. My value target has been eliminated. And there you go, you have it. That mission is done. And now, time to fast travel back to the terminal, get the fourth weekly high value target. And about 15 minutes, we've done three. Not bad, especially when you factor in time to fast travel to do it. It's going to Russian consulate. I think this is one of my least favorite ones because it's so wide open. And with that's bad because with this, you'd want kind of close quarter combat where you can just go ahead and melt the enemies and get through their HVTs quicker. But with this, they've it's such spread out that it can shave time off of you, your time, shave time off. Seems like everyone's out for themselves now. Approaching marked location. So here we go. Now I'm running down. Hello. Hostile detected near me. Taking out the grenade. Additional hostiles, so that means that they're gonna come down from this little door over here. Going after. 
These are white guys, so just go and do handle the numb. Warning. Additional incoming hostiles detected. New waving. Yeah, from that mill door. Also, if you can get a good line of sight on the doorways, you can put a bottle map. I have to go up here because there's a NPC that is up here that's messing everything up. Okay. There may be the game down. And these are the bastions, so that means that. Some of these areas will actually, yeah, some of these areas with the entrances they get stuck. So that means that you've got to actually go straight to the door and like right, fly around up to see if you see it. High value target has been eliminated. There we go, we've got that HVT done, and, oh, okay, can't believe I missed that, so real quick, we're gonna deconstruct, pick this up, and I know that was just gonna make my sweep of everything, making sure I've got all the stuff that I can now that's done and as you see I'm not that happy because that took hey, the longest agent, of everything check. so I think it was like 18 so that was like a 6 minute HVT Real quickly, I'm just gonna go here. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mark all of this as junk, and then then after that, I'm going to just 
that sell all of this stuff at once. You're gonna like what you see. Okay. Sell junk. Good. Everything that's not that's the weaker material, and I'm just gonna deconstruct it. Deconstruct to get a little bit more space. That's what I want. And now, time for Commander Kairos. Just be careful out there. He's an okay? LMB. He's a medic. So mark them. And I can't. This will be interesting because Dragon's Nest, this is an area that I know of that the boss can get stuck. And if you get stuck, then that means that you're gonna have to leave the area. Coming up on our boys at the breach point. Check in with them for your entry. We need to do this mission despite the high probability of you going through and successfully in safe area. eating it. I'm not even gonna go and deal with them. So, yeah, it's gonna follow me. Approaching Mark's so, location. Now with this, gonna interact. Here we go. Warning. Hostile detected near the LMB, so these are the gunners, LMB gunners, they're starting you off, as you saw I got a little bit low, my health, but I killed them, so I had, that's the other thing I've run credit for on my guns, so that means that when I get a kill, I get a third of my health back in the 20 seconds, so I'm, I'm not too much concerned about my health getting Morning. low. Additional hostiles incoming. Next wave. Do it by the numbers. Where they just came from, this is the door that I have the greatest concern about because that is where I the question uh, that the boss will not come to And keep in mind you are this is high risk, so that means that they're going to be a leak sooner rather than later. So, just going through and handle it. Shot grenades make things so much better. Shot ammo. Secured the area in under two minutes. He's done. Come on, and I'm out of combat, so now I'm going to fast travel back to hey. the terminal, 
and here we go. It's one. Just gonna quickly mark all this stuff with junk. And I, I might be able to go every other wave. But in this case, the best thing is I'm just gonna clear it up now. And now, here we go. Connell McGean. Now... Not this. I hate this location. As you've heard me say earlier, it's too wide open. I want something more close quarters. Warning. Now we're exiting the safe area. Here we go. This means to me. Yep, helping us now. Approaching marked location. They're my seekers. Warning. Hostiles detected nearby. Oh, great. So I go up and then they just start to jump down. Great. Right in front of you. Gonna the He's And now they're going to be, I've got that little run to make because they're going to be coming from this little door down here. So they got stuff. Coming. 
If you get things you're getting concerned, just shotgun. Crap, they just fucked me. I didn't want them to fuck you, bitch, too, but. Hostiles incoming. Alert. Heavily armored hostile detected. Colonel McQueen. Here we go. I know you talk it has been eliminated. And we just have to finish taking out the trash. And of course the street trash. Because I didn't handle the street trash there, this street trash right here has now spawned, and so usually you can sneak around there. But in this case, should have handled the street trash sooner, so that now I could have quickly leave. Now that the street trash is done, that was preventing me from fast traveling. I can now go over back and that's also why I hate this location. The street trash that's around is just, it's annoying because it's taking time off. Especially if you're trying to maximize the GE credit so that you can get to stage tier 3, excuse me. So real quickly, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm just gonna quickly mark all this for junk and sell everything that I don't want. And, uh, Best here we deals go. In the city. Selling bulk. Then I'm gonna quickly deconstruct everything that I don't want. Now, Lieutenant Deeb. Intel says this Except one's a real fighter, but my money's on you, okay? You know where is Lieutenant Man, Deeb I can't wait located? Please, not here, not here. Good. Okay, this is a good one. Back to the Napalm production site, where then I'll just turn around, and there it is. Approaching marked location. Warning, now leaving the safe area. So here we go. Just doing this weekly HVT. Um, so handle I kinda figured I kinda figured that's the case. Uh, okay. Hey. Yeah, 
finish in this way, bro. Alert. Additional hostiles inbound. Nope. I didn't. Uh, I didn't. Level three on the global event. Just say they're on live streaming, getting on the. Yep. Come on. Here we go. We've got two more. It's a tough job, but like they say, This one's got a real bad Gotta reputation. love Espadon. Late season. LMB. Woke agent. And where are they? I can't wait to put my feet up and take a break. Dragon's Nest. Below Dragon's Nest. This is not good. I just hope the glitch does not occur here. Because that would be annoying to say the least. We're coming up on our boys at the breach point. Check in with them for your entry. We need those cleaners exterminated. Pronto. Come on. Let's keep this over with. It's on me. Yeah, you can't get out of the 
here we go. Still running around like a chicken with its head cut off because they don't want to get hit by this great bullet. Taking out a mechanic. Hey, there's a tub. Sad when the turrets do more damage than the PCs. That is. Stop. Here we go. Yeah, take out this medic. They left. The they left the that good. This is where they can get stuck on. So he's down. That's the doctor. And now Reaper is over. Here we go. All of this, and in the meantime, I'm gonna pick all of this stuff up real quickly. Real quickly I'm gonna just deconstruct all of this. Construct that because that's something I want. Okay, so gonna quickly de construct this. Here we go. Now, fast traveling back to. This global event leaderboard. So I know we're about 47 minutes in, 48 minutes in, and it it took that long to do eight of them. Part of the reason is that there are some locations that I didn't like that took time away from me so but before I do that let me just 
take all of this that I want to keep and put it in the stash, deal with it later, and in the meantime, time to go ahead and clean all of this up. Another satisfied customer. And now, yeah, we've done all of this, so now, working on the dailies. The dailies will take. I got something you need to shut down. Man, I can't quicker, wait for my feet up. Because the dailies, they're not, they designed not to be as difficult as what was just done. So if you could handle doing the eight day weekly high value targets in 45 minutes and actually that's not bad about six minutes an HVT and that's factoring in fast traveling to the locations and that's getting a good location that you can so I got stuck up on the wheels there. You are now leaving the safe area. Yeah, that's not that bad of a time. So here we go. I'm just ignoring the resources I can get and I'm just gonna only help you people out time. if I can. Location. Going in. They say five, six minutes. I think I could get this done ready for the boss in under a minute is my goal. Warning. Additional hostiles incoming. Wave one is done. Dang, it was under a minute. Alert. Heavily armored hostile detected. High value target has been eliminated. Dang. That was <laughs> done quickly. And now time to fast travel back to the terminal. And here we go. Next one up. is the worst location ever because there's no nothing nearby to fast travel to so you either have to run it from the base of operations or um, or the refugee camp or you're doing what I'm doing and that's going down to Camp Hudson and then just making the long run to it. Ah, this. Mm. 
know this is not a good one. As you can, because sometimes it, with this being the second easiest HVT, then that means that it'll probably there's a good chance that it'll take longer for me to run than to go ahead and get the into yeah it'll take longer for me to run to this HVT than it'll be for me to actually handle and have the boss come out. So, sometimes there's some enemies in here. This time there wasn't, that's good. Run in here. And like I said, I am ignoring all resources because I'm trying to speed up my time so that you're trying to get higher GE credit score. So by skipping resources, you save seconds and that could be the difference between putting you in tier 2 and 3. And uh, I've noticed that sometimes the difference is in HVT. So here we go, jumping down. <laughs> Approaching marked location. Warning. Meant to throw Hostile it on detected the ground. Yep, boss is the help. As you could tell, I threw my grenade seeker mines out, and uh, <laughs> within the they were back by a couple of seconds, and then I killed the boss. So here we go. That is like I said, took longer for me to run to the HVT then to actually kill go through bring the boss out and then kill them <laughs> another Reading one to down. This area is safe. another one to go I know you got a handle on this. Good Four luck. more. Now three more. Real quickly, I'm gonna ammo up. Please let it be in a good place. The last, going to the last call, and I'm just running it. Safe area. Just 
running down here. Do da do da da Oh the do da day. This is doing good work. Colonel Bliss has yeah. got to be shitting himself over what you did. I'll ignore that. Usually I do help, but this time I just felt like I'll just run straight. Someday I'll return the favor. Go. Going up. Up and over. Approaching marked location. Oh, LMB. Come on, jump down. Warning. Additional hostiles incoming. Take this. Now, and then the second wave I've noticed consistently has been this door right here, so if you know where they spawn at, you can get a little bit of a leg up on them. So, here we go. Incoming hostiles detected. Dropped my seeker mine to that. Traveling to the terminal. Get another one hey. done. Here we go. Just who I was looking for. Good luck Blue with this one, Angel. I know you can handle it. And let's see, where is this not needed? Back here.
put it Approaching right Mark's here. location. Warning. Seek the mark. Got another one. One more, then gonna Hostiles incoming. Another wave coming through this door down here. Just like Draco. The one shot. Morning. Incoming hostiles detected. Incoming. Wave is down. Heavily armored hostile detected. They are weak, so Done. Now it's fast traveling back to the terminal and we've got another one. Oh, we've got another one or two. Captain Dent the city and then we Lieutenant Lee, and then we will have done them all. Done all the dailies and the weeklies. Man, I can't Once wait to put my feet up and take a break. Okay, now I'm trying to find them. Man, this location just. This is the third time in a row that I'm here, so, yeah, third time in a row. I think it is, anyway. Here we go, fast, just running straight to it. Those cleaners make me sick. And as you see, I'm running a nomad. My full six-piece nomad. This is... Okay, that's set. And now... Here we go. Approaching Mark's Got location. Then it's Daniel. Warning. Hostile detected me. I know I'm getting hit with 
shotgun. I think it's shotgun. Okay, no, it's not. Next wave up. Bushers. Coming from the top. Again, so these will most likely be elites. And they are, because we get to that end. to the terminal for the last one. Lieutenant Lee. is the last one. Also, another thing that you want to be aware of is your G credits. I started out with 100, 300, and right now I'm at 71, plus this is like 273, so... From doing the weeklies and the, then the dailies, I've gotten 7,000, so I'll have would have earned about 7,000 G credits in about an hour and 10 minutes, hour 5, hour and 10 minutes, and you've got a 10k maximum, so you got, you have to be aware, knowing that, that you got to be aware, okay, and uh, Anything you go over it will it'll cut you off. Approaching so marked here location. We go. Lieutenant Lee. Warning. Hostile detected near Veterans. Got the lead on them. So we go. Hostiles incoming. Next wave. And with this, there's only two areas of entrance. There's a little door that they came from on this side. Reloading. Alert. Additional hostiles in 
inbound. So the door on that side is done. Now they're coming over there. But the first we need to handle the street trash of riders so that they don't mess me up. They shouldn't, but better to clear them out anyway so you don't have enemies shooting at you from multiple sides. Yeah, there's a they glitched out. So that thing is I just have to wait for the glitch to be over. Okay, so they just force them out. seconds at the minimum for them to go ahead and actually glitches could be 30 seconds so them saying being stuck Hostiles in the doorway. Incoming. Now it is alert. Heavily armored hostile detected. Lieutenant Lisa. So shopping them all. Will my seeker mind do the damage? High value target has been eliminated. Down. There we go. Now there's one more. And that is everything. So the dailies for the good done and the weeklies would done doing this global event leaderboard. So I'm hoping that in the next today when it resets I'll come back with an update just to show you where I've gotten on the leaderboard and uh, by doing those I I'm expecting to be high up there. I've got some intel um, you might tier three to the my 
my exact number, I don't know, but I hope you've learned something and I wish you well in all your Division 1 endeavors, and until next time, this is Aesthetic Fame.